She's like, I'm watching you. What's up, everybody? My name is Lehua, and welcome to the Superfina channel. I am a Hawaii variety content creator, host of podcasts across worlds, and I stream on twitch.tv slash Lehua Superfina. Today, we are reacting to how a realist hero rebuilt the kingdom season one, part two. And if you like anime reactions, don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell so you can be notified on the next upload. And if you'd like to support the channel, we've got channel membership, Patreon, and merchandise. Link to those are below. We are reacting to how a realist hero rebuilt the kingdom episode 16 oh episode 16 yo last episode we were talking to um jian jian uh from the grand chaos empire and we were talking about how soma can't really tell between um uh, the different uh demi humans and demons he's like what's the difference and the people of this world are like, we can just tell. And they were talking about how this can be used to discriminate against demi humans. And uh, especially for places that uh, are human superior nations. Yeah. So I think this is kind of foreshadowing that like something bad is going to happen within our non-demon countries like yo we're still not gonna talk to the demons huh but besides that this one the title is called tyranny is more terrible than tigers mm. is it tyranny or tyranny uh tomato tomato but let's watch the episode Mm-hmm, pay for reparations! Did you guys see his face? He was, like, shocked. He's, like, shocked he has to pay. Oh, it's pride! I thought he was broke. Put down that pride. Mm -hmm. Calling him out. We can interview no further. Mm-hmm. You guys were being aggressive. Mm-hmm. Take the consequences. You don't get your nation back. Ooh, that's really bad. You won't get any more protection. Mm, what you gonna do? Oh, they're surrounded by enemies. Flexing military might. Mm-hmm, Julius was pressured. Mm-hmm. 
<laughs> Two years. Oh, but 10 years of installment. How gracious of them. But you're going to be paying it off in 10 years. He's just salty. Gonna need a sister who does the merchant stuff. Collateral? What's the collateral? Is it a person? Oh, he pushed it. He pushed it. Oh, he doesn't care about knowledge. I think that was Soma's plan the whole time. I think he really wanted the books. Who's on the list? Oh, he's okay with the list. Well, he doesn't know. Unworthy! How rude! Oh, does the mom have siblings? Oh, she must be really valuable, Margarita. <laughs> A dig. <laughs> I wonder what's in those books. Like, what information is Soma looking for? I like how formal they made that look with the signing.
He is so salty. Sprinkle more salt. <gasps> what are you gonna say? Uh huh. Oh, he's challenging him as a ruler. He's belittling him. Oh, he was just giving you good advice. Salt. So exciting, yo. Ugh. This dialogue is amazing. Julius is really going to have to prove himself. Especially after the people were able to experience some freedom. <laughs> yeah, anxious. But they didn't like it. Poor thing. Yep, Julius is going to go back to like military mode. That's what Soma was planning for. Oh, the title of the episode. Oh, you better see the harsher side of people's lives. What? <laughs> They're like, bring it on. Mm? <laughs> Ooh, that was a really good scene explaining about that phrase. That's the title of the episode. Janna. Check that off. And then... <gasps> oh! Does she have a sister complex?
We have another sister in the laboratory. So we have a scientist, an empress, and a soldier. Oh, the same as you! Keeps a bed in the office. Wow, they're making him look so good. Look at all those sparkles. Wondered out loud with a straight face. It should be different. Why are you laughing? Were you thinking the same thing? Why are you laughing? Oh yeah, that is funny. <laughs> Ah, they're pointing out the specifics of what the hero would do. Yes, it does. It does feel like a revolution. Very interesting that they're pointing these out. Me too. I'm interested in that conversation. What is this? Cheers! Thank you, adventurers. Are they eating the different dishes that was introduced through that broadcast? Oh. Mm-hmm. Ah. And what? Let her have fun.
Drink all you can. Get a hangover the next day. I don't think he can drink. Mouth to mouth? But where's his mouth? It's covered. She can't see it. Oh, oh. Is he faking that? I think he's faking it. She said, come here. Grab Master Mascot. <laughs> Mmm, she's sensing a potential rival. She's like, I'm watching you. Alicia was sizing her up. What, he was hiding in the costume? Ooh, she sends you those feelings. Oh, oh. Selma, you gave yourself away. And that's my reaction to how a realist hero rebuilt the kingdom, episode 16. Ooh, Julius was so mad. Ooh, he was so prideful. He was like, why should we pay reparations? Mm-mm. This is our country. And I like how Jean was like, but you guys are being aggressive. Except the consequences. <laughs> and it, oh, the dialogue, the lines that Selma was saying, it was like he was doing like subtle insults, but he was also giving advice. Like he was giving sincere advice. I think he really wants Julius to be a good ruler because he cares for the people. Like, he really wants them to do well. And I also think that's because either one, Soma doesn't want to have to take over and take care of another kingdom because he's already got his own kingdom that he needs to be taking care of. Or two, he just cares. You know, he just wants everybody to get along, right? Mm hmm and get a ally and then they can work together later on but i really do think that uh rora is going to be showing up later on i mean she was in the opening yeah i think she's going to take over um the amadonian area and then um, there's definitely going to be an encounter between the Empress and Selma. Guaranteed. Well, maybe not guaranteed. They always like do like some foreshadowing and it never happens. <laughs> For example, in part one, where uh, Tomoe was talking about how she spoke to a demon, but we never encountered demons in that season. Probably not in this season either. But besides that, yo, there's three sisters. There's three of them. There's the Empress. There's the one that is in charge of the military stuff. And there's one that does science in a laboratory. I wonder if she's the one with like the silvery gray hair. Or is it a different girl? Which one's the sister? Besides that, what do you guys think about this episode? What do you think about this video? Let me know in the comments below. And if you want to talk outside of YouTube, there is a Discord link is in the description. I also stream on twitch.tv slash I host Superfina outside of YouTube and Twitch. I host podcasts across worlds where we talk about anime, manga, and other things you're interested in. If you like podcasts like that, link to the podcast is in the description. We're available on all platforms. Other than that, my name is Lehua. And this is the Superfina channel reacting to how a real hero rebuilt the kingdom episode 16. Hope you guys like this video and I'll see you on the next one. Laters!